สตาร์ทพอร์ตได้แหละได้แรกอินเทอร์เน็ตไม่อยู่ในเพจก้องถ่ายไม่มีก้องไม่มีป้ายกำเลือกแรก stop ไม่มีป้ายกำกับ pause ไม่มีป้ายกำกับ pause สวัสดีครับสวัสดีการแต่สองครั้งเพื่อเปิดใช้งานสวัสดีนะครับผมพาร์ทที่สองแล้วนะครับผมจำได้ไหมว่าพาร์ทแรกเราทำอะไรพาร์ทแรกก็คือเริ่มต้นของเกมก็คือเราต้องกดล็อกที่กุมขังของเรานะครับผมเกมเดิมนะครับผมความถี่ที่หายไปอย่าลืมนะครับใครที่จะเล่นเกมนี้หรือว่าจะโหลดเกมนี้ผมย้ำนะโทรศัพท์ของคุณต้องไม่เอี่ยมพื้นที่ของคุณต้องไม่เอี่ยมนะพื้นที่ของคุณต้องให้ได้32ิกบไบต์หกสิบิกบไบต์หรือ128ิกบไบต์ขึ้นไปนะเกมนี้ถึงจะเล่นได้ถ้าเป็น Android Version 1.5 หรือ Android Version 5 Android Version 4หรือไม่ก็ Android เวอร์ชัน10ถึงเวอร์ชัน11เนี่ยผมคิดว่า Android เวอร์ชัน10 Android เวอร์ชัน11เนี่ยผมคิดว่าน่าจะได้แต่ถ้าเป็น Android 5ผมไม่รับรองว่าจะได้หรือเปล่านะถ้าเป็นโทรศัพท์แบบโทรศัพท์เก๊โทรศัพท์ปลอมปลอมโทรศัพท์จอมปลอมเกมนี้ไม่สามารถโหลดได้นะครับสำหรับใครที่ชอบเสียงเกมหรือว่าการรีวิวเกมร้องเพลงหรือว่าใครที่ชอบเพลงนะก็มาที่ช่องผมได้สิทธิ์เก่าทำมิกนะครับติดต่อสอบถามเพิ่มเติมได้ที่เบอร์มือถือนะครับ0 9 8 2 4 1 7 4 5 3หลายแอคเคา B O O T นะย้ำ B W O T นะครับ S O C เอาไม่ใช่ไม่ใช่ไม่ใช่เอาใหม่เอาใหม่ย้ำเอาใหม่ B W O T C O S แล้วก็ S E N ติ๊กต็อกสิทธิ์เก่าทำมิก Facebook b o o t คนบางการ Messenger b o o t คนบางการนะครับผมใครที่อยากแล้วก็ที่เพจนะแล้วก็ที่เพจ B O R เอาใหม่เอาใหม่ถ้าถ้าเป็นที่เพจนะ B O R U T O S E N นะครับผม S E N แล้วก็ S E I หรือว่าอ่าโอเค S E I นะครับผมก็วันนี้นะครับผมเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวถ้าถ้าผมจะไม่ได้เดี๋ยวผมจะพิมพ์ไว้ให้นะว่าเพจผมชื่ออะไรก็วันนี้นะครับเราจะมาเจาะลึกต่อนะครับผมในพาร์ทที่สองพาร์ทที่สองนี้นะครับเราจะเข้าสู่ไนท์คลับนะครับผมพาร์ทที่สองนี้เราจะเข้าสู่ไนท์คลับก็คือเราจะไปคนอ่าเราจะไปหาขอโทษขออภัยอ่าเราจะไปหาคนที่ชื่อว่าดุกดุกเซเวอร์ดุกเซเวอร์กลันคลับหรือว่าเราจะไปหาผู้ดูแลคลับนะครับผมพาร์ทที่สองนี้เราจะไปซื้อเหล้าให้กับ NPC แต่ละคนนะภารกิจถึงจะสําเร็จนะครับสําหรับใครที่ชอบแล้วก็อีกอีกเรื่องหนึ่งสําหรับใครที่สําหรับใครที่ชอบความบันเทิงชอบแบบว่าลงคลิปเต็มเต็มทุกวันให้ไปที่ช่องนี้เลย Nice Official Channel ช่องนั้นอะ่ะเขาไม่มีหลอกเกมอะ่ะทุกคนเขามีแต่ความตลกความบันเทิงอะไรก็ไม่รู้นะเขาไม่มีหลอกเพลงกับเกมวันนี้นะครับย้ำนะใครที่ชอบการรีวิวเกมชอบเสียงเกมชอบเพลงนะ
อยากคุยกับผมอยากสอบถามอะไรผมเพิ่มเติมติดต่อได้ที่เบอร์มืออ่าติดต่อได้ที่เบอร์มือถือศูนย์เก้าแปดสองสี่หนึ่งเจ็ดสี่ห้าสาม l i n e account b o o t c o s e n f a c e b o o k b o o t คนเมืองการ messenger b o o t คนเมืองการ tiktok สิทธิ์เก่าทำมิกเอ่อ uh, youtube ก็สิทธิ์เก่าทำมิกเหมือนกันสามารถเม้นมาคุยกันได้นะครับส่วนเพจนะครับผมโบลูโตเซนเซชาแนลเนาะคือผมอยากจะบอกว่าการที่เราลงคลิปทุกวันเนี่ยผู้ติดตามมันก็จะลดลงถูกไหมแต่วันเนี้ยผมมาลงคลิปก็คือเกี่ยวกับเกมนะโอเคเราไม่พูดพร่ำทำเพลงแล้วนะย้ำแล้วนะครับผมใครชอบคลิปผมการรีวิวเกมเพลงหรือว่าอยากร่วมไลฟ์สดกับผมบน u t u b e ติดต่อผมได้นะทางช่องทางที่ผมให้ไปเมื่อกี้นะครับผมและสำหรับใครที่ชอบความบันเทิงตลกขบขันไม่แบบไม่มีเกมไม่มีเสียงเพลงให้ไปที่ช่องนี้เลยใน Official Channel เดี๋ยวผมจะพิมพ์ชื่อช่องเขาให้บน Facebook แล้วก็บน TikTok นะครับผมเพราะว่าผมคิดว่าใครชอบดูความบันเทิงต้องช่องนี้เลยช่องไลน์ออฟฟิเชียลช่องนี้จะลงคลิปทุกวันนะไม่เว้นไม่เว้นกลางคืนไม่เว้นตอนเช้านะแล้วก็ไม่เว้นวันศุกร์วันเสาร์วันอาทิตย์ก็คือลงทุกวันเอาง่ายๆนะครับผมวันนี้โอเคเราไม่พูดพร่ำทำเพลงเราจะเข้าสู่ตัวเกมกันเลยคุณหาหน้ากันหน้าที่หนึ่งจากห้าขอโทษ Microb settings. Okay. Frequency missing. No, no. Frequency missing. Two. Talk back. April 14. Duel. The chief has given me my first assignment. I'm to interview Samuel Silverglands about the renovation and development of the Duke Silverglands Club. A lot of members are big shots. I'm boss among them. I'm not sure how I feel about this, but I'm going to make the best story I can. I'm already on thin ice. After that incident in the newsroom, sadly, I didn't have time to do much research. But apparently, Samuel Silverglans' father passed away about a month ago. Oh wow! Now I see why the club has Duke in its name. This place looks like something you'd find in a castle, with all the leather, mahogany, and paintings all over the place. โอเคอันแรกเลยนะครับเราจะไปที่คนแรกเลยเราจะไปหาวิกเตอร์นะนายวิกเตอร์ที่เขาขายเขาเป็นเอ่อ,เ,อ,อเทรนเนอร์บาร์ผู้ชงเหล้านะผู้ชงเหล้าหรือว่าชงเบียเราจะไปคุยกับเขาแล้วเราก็จะซื้อเบียร์ไปให้กับคนที่ชื่อ,เอ,อเอาอะไรคุณใจแอนใจแอนสักอย่างนะเกมนี้นะมันมันมีหลายชื่ออะนะโอเคเราจะเราจะมาที่โทรศัพท์บ้านกันก่อนเลย A telephone mm, I don't need to call anyone at the moment โทรศัพท์บ้านหรือว่าโทรศัพท์แบบวางตั้งโต๊ะเนี่ยมันจะไปอยู่ในพาร์ทที่สามของคลิปหน้านะครับผมอันนี้คือคลิปคลิปที่สองพาร์ทที่สองนะครับผมโอเคเบ้าเบ้าเบ้าเบ้าเบ้าเบ้าเสียงร้องเพลงเบ้าเบ้าครับผม The club's bartender Hello I'm Patricia from Radio IDUN Do you mind if I ask you a few questions I suppose that's all right. I'm not too busy at the moment. My name's Victor. Samuel. The club. Buy drink. The club. So what's it like here? Do you like your job? It doesn't pay much, but the status you get from working for such a fine establishment makes it worthwhile. I thought you'd get paid well, considering the high class of this place and all. You would think so, yes. It started to unravel a bit lately. That's why they're opening a new restaurant. 
to make more money. That sounds like an interesting story. What more can you tell me? I've, I've said too much already. Samuel. I'm supposed to interview Samuel, but I can't seem to find him. Do you know where he is? He might turn up soon. There's a lot of work to do before the grand opening. อ่าซึ่งเกมเนี้ยผมบอกเลยว่าเดี๋ยวถ้าผมมีหูฟังบลูทูธหรือว่าหูฟังที่เป็นแบบสเตอริโอซ้ายขวาผมจะทําแบบ
a well-dressed woman playing pool. I didn't even know that kind of shot was possible. Hello, I'm Patricia. Do you have a minute? You new here? The name's Veronica. Yes, I'm here to do a story about the club. Samuel, give drink. Would you like my drink? Turns out I'm not as thirsty as I thought. Oh, thanks. Samuel, do you know where Samuel Silverglands is? Who's that? The club's owner. Sorry, not really a part of that crowd. Samuel. The club. What do you think about the club? It's good enough to play pool in. Except for that fat, obnoxious man over in the corner who smells of cognac. Apparently, he's some kind of hotshot around here. At least it's what he tells anyone who cares to listen. Can't they throw him out so I can play pool in peace? Yes, there's a smell coming from there, all right. Goodbye. Thank you very much. The door to the bar. Victor the bartender. Hello again. Yes. The club. Buy drink. Uh, can I get a drink? What are you having? Gin and tonic. A gin and tonic sounds nice. My pleasure. Goodbye. Thank you so much, Victor. The bouncer for the VIP room. Hello. ไอ้คนที่มันบอกว่าอะไรนะก็คือเรามาถามไอ้คนนี้ว่าประมาณว่ารู้จักเค้าพิเศษไหมอ่าอันนี้ก็บอกว่าบอกไม่รู้จักไ
about that. Uh, rather, he bragged about how he was going to be on the radio. I can't find him. Do you know where he is? Yes. Uh, uh, was he going to be in the car? Yes. Yes, please. Unless it's too much of a bother. Uh, hold on. I'll call him for you. He'll be at the bar in a minute. If you don't get any good answers from that wretch, you can always ask him about our father's foundation. <laughs> Thank you. But if you want to see the clip of the car, you can go to YouTube and on TikTok. I'm on the clip of the clip. 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 The club. What do you think about the club? Ah, uh, Samuel started to renovate the place, and it's turned out rather nice, even if he doesn't listen to my suggestions. He doesn't listen to you? I am part owner, after all. All three of us are, you know. But Samuel was ruled with an iron fist ever since he inherited most of our father's fortune. Didn't you receive an equal share? No. Father handed most of it over to Samuel. Now Sylvia and I have to live on what our dear brother provides. Goodbye. Thank you very much. To the bar. Oh, Samuel is here. Now I can get my interview. Hello, I'm Patricia from Radio IDUN. It's about time you showed up. Interview. Do you have time for the interview now? Yes, that's fine. The club. What can you tell me about the Duke Silver Glance Club? I started it 20 years ago. You started it by yourself? I thought your siblings were part owners. Just because a piece of paper says so doesn't mean they did anything. I built this club from the ground up. The restaurant. The club. The restaurant. And you'll soon be opening a new restaurant that'll be open to non-members as well. What's your view on the future? I thought it was time to do something new when the restaurant business is very lucrative. So it's about money? Don't put words in my mouth. You will cut that from the interview. <clears throat> um, I felt it was time to give something back to the community. My father was a very generous man, and so am I. The family. I talked to your brother earlier. Don't listen to a word he says. So... That's enough about my brother. Your father. 
I realize this is a touchy subject, but I think the listeners would want to hear about your father, who passed away last month. You inherited most of his fortune. I don't hear a question. I'm wondering how this affects the club and the new restaurant. Plans for the development have been in place for a long time. With the inheritance, I was able to realize them. That's all I will say about my father. This wasn't very interesting. Maybe I should ask him about the foundation. Can you tell us a little bit about your father's foundation? I don't want to talk about that. It'll be a better story, and it's something I think our listeners will want to hear about. Uh, I don't think so. Trust me, it'll be great. All right, but keep it short. Thank you. Can you tell me what kind of foundation it is? <laughs> If you haven't even bothered to find out yourself, I'm not going to tell you. No, I only... I only thought it would sound better if you were the one telling the listeners about it instead of me. Well, all right. My father created the Silver Glans Foundation to help the less fortunate. It was something he cared deeply about. Thank you. So, why was it that he gave all the money to you without providing something for the foundation? That's not something I want to discuss. This was supposed to be about my restaurant, not my personal affairs. Your radio station's reputation seems very exaggerated since they said an amateur like you. This interview is over. A sensitive subject, apparently. I can't leave this place without a real interview. Samuel didn't say much before he stormed off. There has to be someone around who can give me a good story. I guess I can snoop around a bit while I'm here. Richard had a member's card for the VIP room. I could start there. Victor the bartender. Hello again. Yes. The club. The VIP room. Could you help me get into the VIP room? It's members only. No exceptions. Yeah. Richard. I actually have a friend, Richard. He's a member here. Do you know him? There was a Richard that started hanging around here about a month ago. I think he was a reporter or something. Radio reporter? I think that's correct, yes. A friend of Samuel's. Didn't have to pay for drinks. When was the last time you saw him? Oh, about a week ago or so. He was really drunk. Had far too much to drink, so I refused to serve him. He got really upset and left the bar, yelling and shouting. That doesn't sound like the Richard I know. The VIP room. The club. Goodbye. Thank you so much, Victor. <laughs> the bouncer for the VIP room. Hello. The VIP. Could I take a look inside the VIP room? No. It's for the story I'm working on. No. Goodbye. I don't think I can get past that bouncer. There has to be another way inside. The lounge. Veronica, the pool player. Hello. The VIP room. Richard, you wouldn't happen to know a man by the name of Richard, would you? Hmm. Yes, there's been a Richard here now and then. Nice guy, likes to watch me play pool. When was the last time you saw him? Not quite sure. I was away last week, so would have been sometime before that. Thanks. The VIP room. What do you know about the VIP room? Only that the people who go there tend to be snobs. Okay. Goodbye. Thank you very much. <coughs> Oscar Silverglands. Hello. The interview. Hey, you tricked me. Samuel was furious when I mentioned the foundation. Ha 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 ha, yeah. I could hear it from here. It actually made my day. The VIP. Can you help me get into the VIP room? Samuel thought I was disturbing the other customers, so he threw me out. Now the security guard refuses to let me back in. So you can't get me in there? No. 
Besides, I don't think you'd fit in there. Goodbye. Thank you very much. เอ่อคนที่ทําอาหารแล้วหลังจากนั้นปุ๊บเนี่ยเราต้องไปปลดล็อกอะไรบางอย่างนะทุกคนเราต้องไปคุยกับเอ่อคนที่ทําอาหาร
Yeah, it's really stressful. I don't understand how Mr. Silverglanz expects me to cook for all the guests in the new restaurant, too. There's no way I can manage it by myself. Goodbye. Thank you very much. Stairs to a basement. Maybe a food cellar? A dark basement. What are you doing here, Patricia? A newspaper with Alan Silverglanz on the front page. It has a story about him and his foundation. Apparently he was a philanthropist who spent a lot of time helping the less fortunate. That's a pretty big difference from his son's. I wonder if his daughter Sylvia is the same. Hmm. A bit strange that he gave his entire fortune to Samuel. A locked metal cabinet. This must be the elevator engine the chef mentioned. Maybe I should try to fix it. Yes, all right. Let's see. I'll try the on button and we'll see what happens. I guess not. I just spun around once and stopped. There are a few different buttons to press here. I wonder what they do. Okay, the engine is sputtering. It's not running with full power yet. It's gaining power. Almost there. Four. That's it. Yes, it's working. First Richard safe, now an elevator engine. I'm really on a roll. The chef. Hello. The elevator. I managed to fix the elevator. I have to thank you. How in the blazes did you pull that off? It was really technical, but I've picked up a few things over the years. Well, if my hands weren't so sticky, I'd give you a big hug. How am I ever going to repay you? Well, could I ride upstairs in the elevator and check out the VIP room? Yes, of course. Goodbye, the club. Okay. Goodbye. Thank you very much. The service elevator. Should I go to the VIP room? Yes. Here we go. I'm going to do the interview of the decade with someone up there. I'm finally in the VIP room. They spared no expense decorating this place. A bearskin on the floor, silk curtains in the windows, and everyone is really dressed up. I hope I can get a good interview with someone here. I don't like all the people around here. Oh, yes. 
I don't like all the people around here. Of course. Absolutely. Shh. That's all I'll say about it. Shh. I don't like all the people around here. Of course. It's all I... An older, properly dressed gentleman. Hello, I'm Patricia. Do you have a moment? Of course. Goodbye. Richard. You wouldn't happen to know a man by the name of Richard, would you? Richard? Oh, yes. He and I are old friends. <gasps> the reporter from Radio IDUN? Yes, that's him. The repo man from the radio stadium. No, a reporter. Absolutely. I love me some Porter. Uh, I think we're talking about different things. About you. The club. Are you enjoying the club? It's a good enough place to rest your feet in any case. I don't like all the people around here. Like that fellow over there by the tape recorder. What do you mean? If he had been under my command, I would have thrown him out right away. That's all I'll say about it. About you. What is your name? General Anderson, at your service. A general? Oh my. Shh. Keep your voice down. The enemy has ears everywhere. What enemies? They hide everywhere. Okay. Goodbye. That interview probably wouldn't have been very interesting. An older woman fashionably dressed in a beautiful red dress. Hello, I'm Patricia. Do you have a moment? Hello, Patricia. I'm Sylvia Silverglans. Oh, really? Is Samuel your brother? That is correct. But it's not something I normally advertise. What's on your mind? What's on your mind? Um... About you. Can you tell me more about yourself? <laughs> well, these days there's not much more to say. Oh. What do you mean? I've worked with the Silver Glans Foundation for most of my life. It's very interesting and satisfying work. But now I'm retired, apparently, so I mainly sit here, passing the time. Oh, my. About you. The club. What do you think about the club? Why do you ask? I'm from Radio IDUN, and I'm doing a story about the Foundation. My interview with Samuel, it didn't go so well. Well, in that case, this is more or less my prison. Are they keeping you here against your will? After Samuel inherited all of Father's fortune, I had no choice but to stay on his good side. <gasps> oh, that sounds so dramatic. Do you mind if I do an interview with you? Well, absolutely. I have a lot to say. When do you want to start? พรุ่งนี้มีไกลทองนะครับผมแปดนาฬิกาถึงเก้านาฬิกาจ้ะทุกวันเสาร์อาทิตย์เวลาแปดนาฬิกาถึงเก้านาฬิกาเนี่ย
But Samuel isn't interested in giving anything away. It's odd that Father gave it all to Samuel. I don't understand it. So you're surprised with the distribution of the inheritance? Yes! He was always so determined that the Foundation would continue after his death. He and Samuel never saw eye to eye, and he hated this club. Too expensive, too snobby, and completely absurd, he would say. Laced with a little profanity, that is. <laughs> what do you think made him change his mind? I don't believe anything could have made him change his mind about that. Samuel must have forced him in some way. But now my beloved father is dead, so there's nothing I can do. <sighs> I'm sorry for your loss. Thank you. Ahem, <clears throat> you there. What do you think you're doing? It's okay. She's interviewing me. You're not in charge here, Sylvia. Security! In here! Good lord. Please escort this insolent girl out of here. I can walk by myself. Sorry, it's my job. Well, at least I got one juicy interview. Back to the office for editing. And now, over to a report on the exclusive Duke Silverglans Club, which is about to open a new restaurant for non-members. Huh, she could have at least mentioned my name. What can you tell me about the Duke Silverglans Club? The Duke Silverglans Club is my jewel and my passion. I want people to come here and forget about their troubles. It's a really beautiful and nice place. I'm extremely pleased to hear you say that. What? That's not my interview. <gasps> Those are my questions to Sylvia, but it's Samuel who's answering. TikTok 13. กันแต่สองครั้งก็เปิดใช้งานกันแต่สองครั้งครั้งไว้เพื่อกดยาวกันดำเนินการใช้งานได้ใช้ใช้สำนึกแบบเพื่อดูชื่อน้องอะไรห